Yo guys, what is going on? Bobby here, and today we have another gun game battle for you guys. So today we're going to be 1v1ing Jigsaw. He's going to be the second pro on the second episode of Gun Game. Hopefully we can get the dub and remain undefeated. If you guys want to watch the last video, the link is going to be in the description below. We 1v1 to OG, and it was a really close and intense 1v1. I'm sorry, I cannot accept your request right now. But anyways, to explain the rules really quickly, how this works is we each start off picking a Trophy Road Brawler. So as you guys can see, we have a lot of options here. Jigsaw also has to pick a Trophy Road Brawler, and the winner is going to move up a rarity. So the winner is going to pick one of the rare brawlers, while the loser is going to stay on Trophy Road. If you win, you move up a rarity. Eventually, you go through all the rarities, and you reach Chromatic. And if you win with your Chromatic Brawler, you take the W, and, the, and you win the 1v1. I could barely English, sorry. But anyways, we're going to hop into it. You need seven total wins to take the W. So we're going to hop into it. We're going to pick our brawler and let's see what we got for you guys today. Okay, so here we go into the game. Now it's first kill wins. First kill takes the W. So obviously we're going to be a little bit passive off the start. Um, we're, the reason we do backyard and not the 1v1 map is because the 1v1 map has no walls, no nothing. So it doesn't promote a lot of tankiness. Here you can kind of play according to whatever play style you want to. So Jig's actually getting a good amount of taps in on us. We're able to hit him twice. Not able to get the kill over there. I'm playing a little bit passive. I'm gonna grab this ball, kind of just throw it over here. Hoping Jigsaw's gonna peek. We got him to peek. There we go. We're one shot, so we gotta back up over here. Maybe we can two tap him quickly. Oh, we're not gonna be able to. He's gonna jump forward and try and make a play. I'm simply gonna jump back, and now I actually have to focus on juking. Gonna be able to juke all of the shots. Now we're gonna move here. Jig is on iPhone, so he can juke a little bit less than we can. It's pretty unfortunate, if I'm being honest. I'm going to launch him back. Kind of a silly play. Oh, and he's going to be able to get us. So Jig is going to take the first game. Jig is going to now be able to move on to the rare brawler. We're stuck on trophy road. Let's hop into the next game and continue. Now, looking at the rare brawlers, there obviously is a strategy to this. Now, he can pick any brawler between Primo, Poco, Rosa and Barley. So I'm considering picking M's just because M's is an obvious counter to the tanks and to Poco. And the only thing that would really counter me is the Barley and I can just try and avoid it. So we're going to go in, we're going to pick M's and we're going to continue and go into the second match. Here we go into it. We're going to change to M's and he is going to be a Rosa. So a really good pick by us. We're going to move forward over here. He seems a little bit sad. We're going to try our best not to throw this one. Gonna knock him back. I kind of threw. Okay, I'm fooling around. I kind of threw. He got the W. I got way too aggressive. So I actually got to focus up right here. So let's hop into the next game. And hopefully we can focus up and kind of clamp this down. Okay, so he moved on. Now the reason... Okay, I have a fair excuse. I haven't played M's in a very long time. And I forgot that the gadget goes so much shorter. Um, that's going to be my excuse. But anyways, he can pick between Daryl, Rico, Carl, Jackie, or Penny. If I were to know Jake, he's picking between Carl or Jackie. So I think what I'm going to go with is Shelly and we're gonna try and make a bold move and let's see if we can get the dub here so he's gonna go Carl we kind of got that counter pick on so we just got to chip until we get super now Carl can take us out so I got to be careful for that I got to be careful here just try and chip away as I get super gonna give him the ball he's gonna try and make some plays using this wall obviously he's gonna get as close as possible try and chip and it's looking pretty good here. Oh, we just got that kill off with 112 HP. If we lost that, that might have been game. But we're able to take the win. So again, let's move on to the next game. And let's improve our rarity to rare and maybe tie things up. All right, so going to the next one. You guys know this, but the options here are Primo, Rosa, Poco, and Barley. So we're just going to go with Barley. Barley is a really good 1v1 brawler. We're going to hide behind walls and be an absolute nuisance until we get the kill. So let's hop into it and let's keep going. Hopping into it here. It looks like he's going to go Carl again. So I do got to keep my distance. I do have the slowdown gadget instead of the healing gadget. Because obviously if he has a tank, you know, that's a counter. And I can try and keep me off of him or keep him off of me. Um, anyways, I'm able to chip him down pretty low. He also has me kind of low though. So it's a little bit awk. I think I'm just going to hide behind these walls over here. Can I even reach them? I can't. Okay. This is a really weird spot to be in, to be honest. He's really looking for his super over here. He's going to be able to get it. I'm going to super down right on him. That's going to force him to move back. He's kind of putting up that car Carl cry over there. Trying to bait him into shooting a shot. He's not going to. So I'm just going to chill over here. Try and chip down until I get my super. 
He's gonna continuously shoot. He doesn't have ammo, so he can just continuously shoot the entirety of this game. He's gonna go try and get closer to me over here. I'm trying to keep him far off. I'm two shots until super here. So this one's been a little bit more passive than the other ones. He's gonna try and make a play. He's not gonna be able to. We're gonna keep him pretty low. All right, we got him back into a corner over here, so hopefully we can get a kill sometime around now. He, we got him pretty stuck. I think we got this over here. He's pretty stuck. He's gonna run into a couple shots. We're gonna try and hit that one. That should be GG. We're gonna hit that last shot, and that is going to be the game. We're gonna tie him up in rarity, so let's hop into the next game, and let's keep going. All right, so here we go into the next game. Now, our options here are Penny, Daryl, Rico, Carl, and Jackie. I think we're going to go with Jackie, and we're going to try and make a bold play right here. Should we be using Hard Hat? I think we'll use Hard Hat, so let's hop into it. Let's see what he goes. I'm afraid he's going to be Jackie. Okay, he's going to be Daryl. I think Daryl actually wins this matchup, unless I play it properly. So I'm just going to try and play this one a little bit smart. going to go right into him over here. He's already really low. I'm going to just give him this ball for whatever reason. He's showing his super... I should have him kind of trapped over here at this point. Jig's going to go for kind of a weird play. He's just going to throw that, and that's going to be an easy win for me. So that's three straight Ws. We're going to hop into the next one. I'm above Jig now. I'm winning 3-2. Let's hop into it. Keep going. All right, so hopping into the next rarity. Now we have the choices of Piper, Pam, Frank, BB, B, and Nani. So we have quite a few options. Um, knowing Jig, he's still probably going to go with Carl or Jackie. So what I think I'm going to do is go with BB and try and just counter it. If it's Jackie, it's not that hard of a counter. I'm going to have to play it properly. Okay, he's going to go with Daryl. So this is still winnable. Um, let's see. I think I'm just going to try and get as many knockbacks as I can. And then when he gets rolls, I'm just going to save my knockback. Oh, I kind of threw. Okay, I already threw. Never mind. <sighs> okay, so he's able to tie things up. I threw that one so hard. He got his super so much faster than I thought. I'm not playing this passive at all. But anyways, again, let's hop into the next game. It's a tie game. 3-3. We each need four more wins. So let's hop into it and let's keep going. Okay, so I'm going to switch my brawler to Pam over here just because Pam is a lot thicker. And looking at the other brawlers, it's more tanks. And I feel like with the three gadget uses that I can kind of just spam at the start, Pam is going to be pretty good. Now he's going to go Piper. So all I have to do kind of is just juke a few times and just try and get to his side of the map. And once I'm there, I will be fine. Gonna be able to juke a couple shots over there. Gonna just try and give him. Oh, he's mm, very interesting use. He's gonna be using that uh, gadget instead of the other one. So we're gonna have him trapped in his own side. He doesn't like the position he's currently in. He's gonna try and make a play, but he knows that there's basically nothing he can do. Okay, good play by Jig. I respect that. He's gonna waste a couple shots over there. If he hit those, it would have been really good. Now he's running out of real estate here. He's got one more gadget that he can use to keep him away from me he's playing this super passive this is kind of toxic i feel like this can end all day jig's gonna try and make an escape we're gonna juke a couple times just gotta hit him one time gonna be able to do so gonna hit him again and that should be it for jig gonna throw that turret on him and that's gonna be it so thank you to jig for not just standing behind that wall for two minutes because that would not have been very fun we got that game over with so four three for me let's keep moving on to the next game and let's keep it going all right, so 4-3 for, for me. We're going to be moving on to the next rarity. So we got Max, Mr. P, Gene, Tara, Mortis, and Sprout. Now, Gene is probably not the best 1v1 brawler, but out of all the brawlers that we faced against OG, Gene was the easiest for me to win with. I don't know why. It just felt better. Oh, I used the wrong gadget. I should use the other one. Not gadget, sorry. Star power. So we'll see what we can do. But against BB, I feel like BB can kind of just run at me. So this one's going to be a little bit difficult. I got to get my super. I'm going to be able to gonna knock that bb back i'm so screwed there's nothing i can do here i'm so ridiculously screwed just gonna let him knock me into that corner gonna knock him back trying to scare him oh he's gonna take the shot i think he threw there we go jigsaw through and we somehow beat him with gene five three for me let's hop into the next one and keep things going all right, so we've won on Gene. So now we're moving over to Legendary. He's running out of time to beat us. So just going back and looking at the Brawlers, he's got a lot of variety of Brawlers, so I can't really just try and counter pick. So what I think we're going to do is go with Crow and use the shield. And he is not going to expect this at all, and I think I can get a really good assassination kill on him. Hopefully he doesn't go Pam because... Can he go Pam? I forgot if he's in that tier, but if he does go Pam, that is an automatic win, so let's hop into the game. 
let's get things started all right so let's go into the next game now unfortunately he went piper that's not really what i was hoping he would go but we'll see what happens I'm trying to keep my distance if i get one super it's over for him i just got to get that super let's get as close as possible here i'm going to be able to hit him once and now he's kind of backed up into his spawn over here he's going to put that crying piper we're going to put that ball in the corner over there and i think crow was the right pick i think we got a kind of trap him but we do have him trapped oh this is kind of scary now i know he's in that bush so I, oh oh that's kind of toxic all right well now i'm kind of trapped but i think it's okay i don't think it really matters um let's see i gotta just try and get super but it's so hard if he's keeping his distance properly he might think about jumping on me with piper i'm not sure hopefully i can bait a jump and then just follow him Okay, I'm going to use my uh, shield. going to back up. Oh, I'm one shot. This is kind of Scott. Uh, I don't like this. I was going to say scary, but then I mixed scary with toxic. But anyways, we're pretty close to our super over here. Again, just trying to get it. That's all we've been doing all game. Oh, we threw. Oh, I had to use that. I had to use the shield. Oh, we're still alive. Yes. Oh. No, we're going to die. And he is going to die like one second later. So Jig gets the kill. That's four wins for Jig. So Jig now has more wins than OG got. Is OG a better player than Jigsaw? I don't know, but let's hop into the next game. 5-4, things are getting kind of intense. Okay, so as things are getting a little bit more serious, we're gonna try and see if we can get that counter pick. So we can pick between Mortis, which he might go. I doubt he goes Mr. P, maybe Gene. I think it's between Mortis and Max, if I were to make a guess. And if I were to face those brawlers, I think I'm gonna go Sandy and try and outplay him. We'll see what I can do, but this one, this brawler is really good for shooting around walls, obviously. Sandy's just super toxic with those wall peaks, so let's see what he goes. He's going to go max, okay. So not a bad pick. I was thinking about going spike, but spike is a little bit difficult against a max, and I was pretty sure he was going to go max, so this is a good pick. Going to move back over here, play it a little bit passive. I just need to get my super so that he can't regen. That's kind of my goal here. He's playing it super passive. So it's going to be a little bit difficult for me. There we go. I'm able to gain two shots right over there. I'm going to use my sleep, gain my HP back. He's probably just lurking in this grass somewhere over here looking for an auto aim battle, which I'm kind of scared of. I do not want to auto aim battle. Okay, I lost. Yep, that's it. Max is such a good brawler. So it's going to be five wins apiece now. So it's basically a best two out of three. Whoever wins the next two games is going to take the W. This is really close really scary i don't want to lose the jigsaw so let's hop into the next game things are really heating up let's keep it going okay so now we're on the same tier jake has to pick anything between spike sandy leon and crow we did leon last time didn't work out i think we did crow last time didn't work out looking at these brawlers i think i'm gonna have to go with curveball spike now it's kind of a dirty pick but it is what it is so let's hop into it and let's keep going Okay, so here we go into the next match. Now, this is pretty obvious. I kind of knew he was going to go curveball spike. Now, Jig's doing way better than OG low key. So let's see how this ends off. He gets one hit. He gets two hits on the RNG. Okay, we only got one. That's kind of toxic. Going to try and hit him here. There we go. That's two hits. Maybe three. Not three. Okay. I think I'm doing a little bit better than he is at this point with the RNGs. Got two really good shots over there. Two really good jukes as well. Hit him. Okay. Looking good. We need one more hit. Oh my god. If that hit us. If that full hit us somehow. I would have been so mad. I think he's one shot from super. I think so are we though. Gonna throw that. Okay. Jig is trapped. There's no way he wins this. There's one. There is two. And we are gonna move on to the final rarity. Let's see if we can get the bag. Let's see if we can take the W. Let's hop into it. And let's see if I can get that win. Okay, so hopping on to the last game, we are now moving on to Chromatic. So we have the choice between Gale, we're not playing Gale, Surge, or Colette. Now, Colette is a really good brawler against tanks, but he's not going to be running a tank. He's going to be running a Spike, a Leon, a Sandy, or a Crow. So I'm going to go with Surge, and I'm just going to hope I can TP on him and get the kill. Now, the reason last time I didn't use Surge is because Surge is really good when it's leveled up and not that good at the start, but I feel like we can win that early game. So he's going to go Crow. So good pick by him. That's the one I really didn't want to face. So let's see what I can do right off the bat. He's going to use Gadget. I'm just going to try and get to level 2. I have three total Gadgets. I want to be able to get my kill with my last one. He's obviously got Shield. He's popped one. 
think I'm just going to TP to an area where I can kind of just run back. Going to be able to get one hit over there. No, he's going to tie it up with the crow. And it's going to be a 1v1 on the chromatic brawler for the win. A best of one. This is looking kind of scary. So let's hop into the last game and let's see who takes the W. Okay, so we're going to go Colette just because, you know, it's probably the better pick out of the rest of the brawlers. We're going to play this one super sweaty. We do not want to lose to Jig. Losing to Jig is not the most OP of strats. We're both going to hit each other one time off the bat. Got to flex my Colette pin, you know, of course. So we both have one hit. Try not to feed each other here. Um, oh, I thought I hit that shot. So he's going to hit another one over there. We're going to back up. We're going to hit another shot. So again, tie 2-2 two -two game right now in hits. So we're both halfway to super. Jig almost predicts us. We're going to get one shot. He's going to use a lot of ammo over there. Oh, we're going to miss that. So we're just going to back up. Oh, this is kind of scary. We're going to back up over here. If Jig kills us, I'm going to be so sad. So he's kind of got me backed up. I have my super. He has his super. It's kind of a peaking game right now. Going to be able to get another hit. Another one. And there we go go i'm gonna be able to take the w now it's a very weird place to do my outro but i'm just gonna do it right here so anyways it's gonna be the video this was a very very intense one i literally won in the very last match idle disconnect i'm not here it's okay but anyways that is going to be it i hope you guys enjoyed again this is a really fun series i have a lot of fun recording it there's tons and tons of pros that i would love to face so if you guys want to keep watching it let me know leave a thumbs up sub comment down below you guys already know so that is going to be it thanks to jigsaw for ho uh, for playing with me his uh youtube is going to be in the channel description below so to make sure to check that out we literally shouted him out like two videos ago so we're kind of farming him subs but anyways it's going to be it thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys again tomorrow peace